He says he's a mere beginner, but at the age of 102, he just can't stop painting. Lister Holland may have come late to picking up the brush, but he has no intention of putting it down now. At a weekend exhibition, he was as much on show as his work. Jeff Sims has this portrait of the artist from his appropriately named hometown of Young in the southwest of New South Wales. Lister Holland loves painting, but an artist? No, I'm only a beginner. <laughs> I'm the second child, but I'm just starting off afresh. He can't stop. It gets in your blood, I think. Once you start, I think you can see art in everything you look at. At 102 and a half, Lister Holland is remarkable for more than painting. He doesn't smoke or drink, yet his diet will have doctors reeling. Plenty of salt, plenty of sugar, plenty of fat, and uh, I think that's what keeps me going. After a blemishless driving record of 81 years, he's only recently sold his car and downsized. He was in his 70s before he picked up a brush, but really only got going once he'd reached his century. He has a thing about trees. You look at an old tree and you think the story that tree could tell you if we could only talk. At the weekend, he exhibited with other local artists. Lister Holland's paintings are the feature of the exhibition, yet not one of them is for sale. Every last one of his paintings has already been earmarked by his children, his grandchildren, and his great-grandchildren. That means a lot of painting. Six children, or five of my own and one adopted. We've got 18 grandchildren alive, 34 great-grandchildren. The paintings have all been labelled and were just on loan. It was the admission price that went to a local school, and he inspired some other old-timers. I thought they were too old to paint, but well, now they might better make a start. Perhaps even his son, Nevin, who's a mere 70. He never started till he was 70, so I've probably got some hidden talents that just haven't come out yet. But no-one's about to upstage his dad. Jeff Sims, ABC News, Young.